Alright, so hope you all doing well and today we are looking at the leaked benchmarks of the Intel Core i5-13500 compared to a lot of Intel CPUs actually. It's been leaked that it will go for $248 or $250. Now this CPU has the same exact core count uh, compared to the 13600K meaning this is a 14 cores 20 threaded CPU but this is not the biggest deal actually in my opinion. Now I'm, now, I'm not gonna go through all the specific stuff and the detailed info because all I'm interested in is comparing this cpu to the upcoming ryzen 5 7600 now yeah we also have some leaked benchmarks with the ryzen 5 7600 but uh, this one is coming from geekbench now this cpu is supposed to be uh, common with a uh, cpu cooler with it and this is a six core 12 thread the cpu now hey when it comes to the multi-core performance uh for the ryzen 5 7600 first benchmarks we are going to see the same exact performance compared to the i5 12600k so this is actually a pretty decent results uh, for a 6 core 12 threaded CPU basically. I'm pretty sure we will see uh, this CPU going for cheaper than $240 because the 7600X itself goes for $230 right now on a major uh, discount. So is the Ryzen 5 7600 going to flop? This is not the end of the discussion here because getting back to the i5-13500 benchmarks, we are going to see some really, really cool results when it comes to the multi core of course uh, we are looking at the same exact performance but once you do the pl1 overclocking or remove the tdp limit of the cpu with a decent cooler you'll have a same exact performance of the i7 12700k so it looks like for 250 dollars you are getting a really good cpu for the multi-threaded performance a beast of a cpu with 20 threads this will tear the hell out of the <laughs> cpu intensive tasks for a really good value in my opinion so when you compare that to the Ryzen 5 7600, I think that Intel is taking the edge here and actually Intel is taking the edge for gaming too when you compare the 7600X to the 13600K. The 13600K is actually faster on average. So yeah, it looks like Intel is taking over as I'm telling you. But yeah, we will have a really good competition once uh, the A520M boards drop, which are boards that will be for under $100. This is what AMD has been stating. Oh, but yeah, it looks like the i5-13500 is gonna be a beast of the CPU. Um, I haven't talked that much on it because it really speaks for itself. Uh, for $250 and a B660M board and a 32 gigs of DDR4 RAM, this is a very good budget PC combo in my opinion. You can even pair it with something like an RX 7900 XTX or an RTX 4080 and you will get really really good performance. So yeah, I'm waiting for this CPU, it looks like the next big thing. And yeah, that's been it, if you like the video, press on that like button, if you want to see more videos with that, can subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.